Hi, I'm going to try to connect the Chameleon Braille display to a PC laptop. I'm going to tap the power on my um, laptop here, and the Chameleon is not plugged in. It's turned off. I have a cable for the Chameleon from the USB port of the PC and to the um, USB-C port on the Chameleon. The laptop's booting up. It's running NVDA screen reader and we'll see if it uh, behaves well. I'm hoping I get NVDA coming on right away so we can log in with it. Narrator has been coming Window on. Sign in dialogue. Excellent. There's the NVDA on sound. Narrator reads aloud text on the screen. And for some reason, narrator is, is being offered right now. Um, but I don't want to use it. Narrator, hear text <laughs> on screen aloud. Okay, so let me log Magnifier in here. Magnifier can enlarge part space. Windows default. Secure desktop. Windows sign in dialog Logan. Password edit protected. Star. Circle. S -s star. S -s star. So, um, ease of access has turned on the magnifier, which... Magnifier. I don't know desktop. why. Close. Okay, so I think we're good. Um, let me try Windows D. Folder view list. Good. NVDA Logan not selected. NVDA is running, and um, we're logged in. So now let me go ahead and plug in the chameleon. There's going to be two things we need to check: um, whether the chameleon is set to a Braille display in the settings under Terminal, and if the if on the PC if NVDA has the Braille display set in the settings. So I'm plugging in the chameleon on the display. It says charging right now. I'm going to hold the back power button on the left side. Okay, that was the sound that the PC has connected to some hardware like this external device. Um, let me hold the power button on the chameleon. Good, we got um, starting. I mean charging, um, so let me hold that a little bit longer. It was getting power, now it's starting up. We get a, a vibration. Okay, the chameleon just said editor, and then we heard the disconnect and the connect sound on the PC. So let me go to my desktop again. This PC two of 16. Okay. Um, so right now, I don't see what NVD. I don't see what NVDA is setting on the chameleon. The, chame Editor. the chameleon is um, at the top of it, the menu. So um, let me check the Braille display in the chameleon first. So I want to go to the terminal um, option menu. So I did that with the right thumb key, or I could do that with my first letter navigation. Let me go into that. Connected devices. Connected devices. Let me look there. USB connection. Yep, I want to look in USB connection. And it didn't say it, but right now it says Braille display. So let me um, hit a cursor router key to select that. This PC window. Okay, cool. Items view list. So... Folders. Um, right now on my display, it says this PC window, so it is acting as a Braille display. So if I go to my desktop, folder view list with Windows D, and I'm this using PC two of six, and I, if I use my arrow keys on my laptop, I can look around the what's on my desktop. One with type ability three of Google Chrome four of sixteen, and now that's um, coming up on my Braille display. I can move with the Braille display. I won't hear what. Um, what things on the laptop um, desktop that I'm getting to, but I can read them on the display. So let me just double check and look in NVDA so we know where that is, where the Braille display is set. So to get to the NVDA settings, I want my NVDA key, which on this laptop is set to caps lock and N. So modifier key, um, NVDA key or caps lock, 
and the letter N. NVDA menu. So there's an NVDA menu. I can use first letter navigation, or I could arrow down to preferences sub menu P. Preferences. I can hit enter there, or go to the right arrow. Settings. I'm gonna select S. that. NVDA settings. General. Normal configuration. Dialog. Okay. So categories. List. So in this category. General one of. In this categories list, there's um, several, you know, 13 or 15 choices. Braille is down a couple, so let me arrow down to that. Speech 2 of 13, Braille 3 of 13. Okay, now I'm going to um, tab to look further in that menu. Braille property page. Braille display grouping. Edit read only multi-line automatic. Human wear Braillean by slash B series slash. Okay, so, so I'm in a um, box and the Braille display had been automatically set um, to the human wear Brailleant, and that's what has worked in this case for me. If I tried to set it specifically to the Brailleant, it didn't work, but leaving the Braille display on automatic has worked. Change, output table, com, input, So now I'm just gonna hit okay. Desktop list. And Google Chrome for us. Great. If we wanted to open a Word document, I can um, get there on my chameleon or use my arrow keys and on the desktop. Microsoft off. Document one Microsoft Word. Okay. Micro now on my Braille display, I have my blinking cursor and I'm ready to write. Dot six T H H I S is a A N E dot new D. C. Doc. Okay, great. This is a new doc. So that's, um, I can use the chameleon as a braille display to read and to write hooked up to the PC.